Ninja! Some mosquitoes, so annoying.
ninja, ninja, ninja. Ninja Gaiden! Fuck 
fucking bugs! <laughs> Damn, I'm glad I don't have to fight this guy again, what the hell? Good. This guy's a cyber ninja, not just a regular ninja. Ninja. Ah, I forgot about that. Spanish. Meticulously crafted bubbles. I didn't have to even go back there. Fuck. 
Ah! Uh. smelly. Oh, that's like a save point for me. Besides weapons, upgrades. The knife, the sword, and then up and up and sword is like the shuriken, I think. Let's see. Oh no. Oh, sword is square. Then up and square is then shuriken. Then X is jump. That's all I really need. Yeah, get those yellow things sometimes to make things go. How do you do the shooting? Shuriken, up and sword, the square. Need the blue magic container for that. You don't have like a lot of energy at this stage of the game, so you have to look out for those spikes and things falling and the lasers. Whoa! I think the uh, orange ones are health, blue ones are spirit and magic. For the shurikens, you hit those. Mosquitoes all the time, the big ones, they tend to turn into small ones. You can kill those lasers too, to get close enough. Almost like it drops some health too. Not the last fight. Good job! Oh, I jumped into this fight. This is like a very popular game, Ninja Gate and Diamond. Not Nintendo Ninja Game, it's like a Cyber Ninja. Got some cyber skills! Flash that laser, that health. Those are huge here in this future. <laughs> yeah. 
just as annoying in the future as they were in the past, actually more so. The gigantic mosquitoes. Cyber mosquitoes. Gotcha. The mosquitoes in the future are killers. Fucking mosquito. Well, wow. I don't have any. Where I go? <laughs> I was about to get smashed, I thought. Good. Yes, that point. That's what I need. Yes. 
of balance the servants of the eternal dragon our ancient land they're ended by those we trusted they're carried by one of our own kind what set this in motion and how could we have not person that's i don't know Scrambler, he's called. You want to the scrambler? I scrambled your eggs. Oh, what the fuck, I'm dead. <laughs> Damn it.
Before I kill most of our clan and the rest were captured by synthetics. They drained me of my power to enhance their own. Our master must be freed before all is lost. Okay. I rose to the challenge. Hurrah, hurry, kalu kale. Attack on ground. Okay. How do I attack on ground? Oh, cool. Go like that. See? Rising fire! Attack on ground. It's my robot assistant. It's like my pit boy. Find me a moment to breathe, it's time for I fill you in. When you get to Mecha City, you'll notice things have changed. Not for the better. Let me bring you up to speed. You knew Dr. Progen is the greatest mind in Mecha City. He built a machine capable of self-sustained autonomous function. A synthetic humanoid. They served as laborers, police, domestic service. Mecha City was safe and prosperous. Our clan found new purpose in upholding this peace. Our commitment was total. Missions to dispose of malfunctioning synthetics were conducted in secret. One day our master got injured in a freak accident. She was left clinging to life. Dr. Progen grew increasingly desperate to save our master. There were all kinds of rumors, strange experiments, disappearances. Voucher, our clan had began to drift apart. And then the explosion, it leveled the whole city. In the wake of the destruction, all of the machines went berserk. As for Dr. Progen, driven mad with desperation, he became something else entirely. He's been tearing through Mecha City, hunting down survivors with his synthetic army. The situation is grave. We were very able to find and save you in the time. But all that matters now is finding and releasing our master. If you fail, Mecha City will only be the beginning. The destruction will keep spreading. You can do it, Shadow. I know you can. Thanks, robot. Pretty cool game, huh? Damn, on stage three, Mecha City Ruins. Yes. Yeah. 